I'm Elizabeth Grube. I'm originally from Wisconsin. I went to school at Mississippi State and studied interior design. I took a bunch of art courses that got me interested in painting. Then I moved to Chicago to practice interior design for two years before moving to LA where I currently work as an interior designer for an international architecture firm. It's hard to pinpoint exactly when I started painting because I grew up in a very creative household. My mom had a studio in our house and she was an artist, so we were always creating from a young age. My current work, the paintings that I've been working on for the past few years are very um, urban and architectural. They're very colorful, vibrant, energetic. Um, I kind of just get in the zone and I'm very passionate when I when I start painting and I, uh, it's layered and thick and, and messy. I feel like I see inspiration in almost everything I see during the day. So little things can inspire me to do a painting and, and motivate me and drive me. Um, I feel like I keep painting uh, because it's, it fulfills the really creative side of my, the right side of my brain. And although I'm an interior designer by profession and that's creative, it's not creative enough for me in the, in the corporate world, so um, I, it's a little more left-brained and technical, so I use my painting as an escape to kind of fulfill the, the need for the right brain balance. I'm not necessarily influenced by a specific era or artist. I tend to find uh, my inspiration through walking through cities, traveling through cities, uh, viewing photographs of urban environments. The energy, the people um, has a lot of vibrancy to me. I love the urban environment. So um, I feel like that's reflected in my paintings and the color. The color is reflective of more of the energy, not the specific, uh, specific thing. I get a lot of support from my family and friends in my painting and my art. Uh, my mom has been the biggest cheerleader since I was young. I don't paint to uh, evoke a specific reaction from people. I feel like each painting inspires each person in a different way. As cheesy as it sounds, don't be scared to follow your dreams and pursue what you're passionate about. And don't let any restrictions hold you back and just do what you do and do what makes you happy.